Wow, we just watched uh, The Big Short, and let mm. me tell you, I am ready to pretend I know everything about yeah. it. About finance. Credit swaps or something? It's a movie about my dick. It's called Credit, Credit Wife Swap, and it's hey. where Adam tries to make money by letting people fuck his ass. <laughs> Whose wife Who's is he? Wi- wi- You're, the wife. Wife. Yeah. You're the wife. You're the wife. A guy swaps his wife for your ass. <laughs> yeah, I trade. <laughs> Adam invented a financial. What he did is people trade their wife to Adam to fuck Adam in the ass, and then Adam gets the sells wife. the wife. Yeah, Adam sells. Uh, then he, the wife puts smart on business. a strap on yeah. him and fucks him. And then yes, the wife fucks him also. And then, then they steal the money he got from selling her pussy. Oh, well, it's all part of my business plan <laughs> to, lo- to lose money. Oh, yes, bitch. Speaking of business plans, so I reached out to Casper Mattresses because mm-hmm. I know they sponsor a lot of New York podcasts and asked them to sponsor mine in exchange for a mattress. And they ignored my email. So <laughs> fuck that company. That's yeah, the official stance of me. I got a tough fuck. needle mattress. Fuck Casper. Which bitch. is uh all right, you know, they didn't give me a free mattress either. What the fuck, dude? We should get a free mattress. Well, what There's a hundred mattress companies. I, what I want now that I A hundred. Like, I didn't know <laughs> at least. <laughs> oh nice. At least a hundred. There's a hundred mattresses. <laughs> you know what the fuck I'm talking about, bitch. <laughs> what are you laughing at? There's a hundred fucking in a box. I've said that there was one hundred mattress companies he just means a lot have you never heard an <laughs> estimation in your life before? i think there's more you think there's more than a hundred listen i just watched the big short so i don't joke around about numbers yeah here's a number for you five five and three quarters Suck my dick that's uh... <laughs> yeah that's the inches that are gonna go in your ass soon yeah here's the number for you hmm. three-fifths and that's what Slaves were counted as during the three fifths compromise. Anyways, uh, yes. so, but I'm looking at Marriott, Scott. Oh, yeah, you want to buy nice sheets, huh? Well, no, I mean, Marriott has the whole bed, and I figure if you're going to spend $1,400 on. Oh, one, that's for the bed? One set of sheets. No, that's just the bedding. The bedding is thirteen fifty, right? Yeah, if you go to shopmarriott.com, you click on the Marriott <laughs> bed. There's, wait, Marriott has a store? Yeah, dude. What else they yeah. got in there? They got a little little bottle of Robes shit? probably. Robes. Probably those slippers. They got fucking jizz Terry everywhere. Cloth shit. Every hotel remote is definitely covered in jizz, right? Mm-hmm. For sure. Here's my question. Why can't guys wear juicy track suits? You know I would be all the fuck over that. Yeah. Why not? They don't make them nice. in my size. Which I would is, wear a juice. I guess they make velour tracksuits for men. Hold on, hold yeah. on. Which is better, inner spring mattress or a foam mattress? Spring, uh, I, I mean, think. It's personal I, preference? I, I, it's personal preference. I have a foam. Do I have a foam? You have Tufted Needle, right? Either Tufted Needle or Casper. I don't remember. I threw one away because I thought I had bed bugs. They're foam. Okay. Yeah. Those are foam. I mean, those are like inner... You get those online and they're like rolled up. I feel like you fuck better on a spring mattress. Why? I don't know. I, th- I I just feel like I have. I don't know. I feel like a spring mattress is kind of like a waste of space almost, right? If you slice it like a like a piece of cake, there's a ton of air on the inside there. Yeah, but... Oh, here you go. Get that spring, that nice yeah. bounce so when you're fucking... So here's for the Platinum Stitch skins. Bed and Bedding Set from ShopMarriott.com. Mm-hmm. You're going to choose the mattress type. We'll go foam, size, we'll go queen... Mm-hmm. I don't know. You don't need a king. Adam sexual. Uh, you're gonna you're gonna be f- you're a fucking idiot. Orientation. Yeah. Why, dude? King would be nice. You're like a king in, in a king. You need a City? big bedroom for a king. That's true. Yeah. I mean, yeah, we don't we don't have the space. But why they why is it called a California king? That's my uh, question. Because it's a different shape. It's it's bigger though, right? No, it's a different shape. It is bigger. A regular, it's longer. It's longer, but a regular king is four inches wider. Mm. Oh, it's, 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 California, California King California is narrower. King, California King swaps four inches out of the width for length. Interesting. Oh. Um, but then there's also a Texas King, which is extremely rare, and it's like <laughs> three times the size of both. Oh, of that's them. real. I thought you were going to say it's like it executes retards or something. Uh, no, that's any that's any bed. <laughs> yeah. They get caught up in there. They can't get out. No. So, <laughs> Wait, how do they sleep <laughs> if they get caught up in the bed? Upside down. Standing uh, up. Oh, oh like bats. From yeah, like, yeah, like, like vampires. <laughs> yeah. yeah, they go They go out at night and they suck candy out of vending machines. <laughs> yeah. I want to suck your candy. <laughs> I want to suck your candy. 
<laughs> you Twizzlers. I want to suck your candy. <laughs> My uh, name is Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> you retarded Elmer Fudd who thinks he's Dracula. <laughs> oh, oh, it's me, Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, dude. This is a real good one. <laughs> I want to well, see how specific. We're three minutes in, dude. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't bank on it. So $3,400. You can get the whole thing. Now I feel like a dummy for wasting my money on a tough to needle mattress. Yeah, dude. When I could have been living like a like a businessman, like, yeah, like, like a, a guy a traveling on his wife. salesman going around town. You know, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll stay at the Marriott. <laughs> I yeah. used to stay in the Econo Lodge, but I got HIV there one time. <laughs> I got it taken care of, but <laughs> boy, I tell you, never again. No more kind of lodges after that. How did you get it that. taken care of? Don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't have it anymore. I've decided. You know, I mean, that's the thing about the, yeah. that's miraculous. Do you know who Ray Sharkey is? Mm-mm. He was a uh, an actor from the eighties, but he had, he got HIV from sharing needles back when it was like gays only. Oh you know? damn! Pause. Keep your mitts off HIV, straight guys. Yep. This stuff is gay. <laughs> yeah. uh, Ray Shark got it. And then his agent was like, all right, here's what we're going to do. We're not going to tell anybody. Not even women that you sleep with. <laughs> so he was just yeah. giving people AIDS? Yeah, he was giving like all <laughs> these women AIDS. God forbid he put on a fucking condom. Man, yeah. salute. I mean, I no, don't respect what he did. That he like killed. No, that's oh, horrible. Jesus yeah, Christ. he's a murderer. Yeah. He really, but the man is a murderer. He's committed to raw dogging. Yeah. Uh, it's, I yeah, don't respect he gave, it. Like, he gave like one interview right before he died. I would never do it. Where, where they were like asking him, they're like, so you you were just giving people AIDS. He's like, ah, well, the, the disease is a funny thing. Sometimes you have it, sometimes you don't. <laughs> and like, no. Yeah. <laughs> you just it's not diarrhea. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. He's just in denial until the day he died that he, you know, he just Damn. Was convinced he didn't have AIDS. When he's he, going around at 75 pounds, you know. Adam, uh, you might have AIDS, dude. Why? I mean, you have the body because type. I don't weigh a lot. Yeah. Have you ever had a venereal? Um, I don't think I'm so. I'm crystal clean, baby. No, Adam got it from sharing needles, mm. from sharing estrogen needles with the, <laughs> the other fellas down at the clinic. From Sharon needles, he fucked Sharon needles, the drag queen. Yeah, thank you. That's a RuPaul's Drag Race reference. Oh, it's a great show. I've seen it, I think, once or twice. It's very good. I was a contestant. Lou yeah. Rawls Drag Race. Yeah. Lou Rawls Drag Race. <laughs> <laughs> Lieutenant Rawls Drag Race. Um, damn, bro. So, um, yeah, you're going to get a little bedding, you know? I just bought a fucking, I just bought a cold brew c- container. That's, so that's, pretty that's nice. pretty nice. Oh, yeah, we said we were going to review that. I haven't sure. bought it yet, but I just got it off Amazon, and it, it works great. So that's, yeah. a, that's a tax Stuff write-off. Stuff the Needle sent me this free mug. Wait, seriously? Yeah. Oh, it's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. No, How much put, for I, a $700? I just put the sticker on that. Oh. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you trick us so, Nicholas? I'm a trickster, dude. That's true. You know? you're, you're Loki. We're entering, yeah, we're entering my, my, <laughs> my moon phase. I'm a trickster moon. <laughs> I love all the trickster gods and shit. The Greek, the, the, little, the little satyrs and mm-hmm. shit. Satyrs? Yeah, he was a... Uh, he was like a half half man, half goat, and he was horny as shit, and he was a trickster. He was oh. just like a little goat guy who was fucking... Isn't that Pan? Maybe it was Pan. But I think they're called satyrs. And, uh, How they about ma- this? Poon's Labyrinth, and it's about a vagina that twists and turns. Yeah. And, ah, yeah. interesting. You know? Yeah. I've never seen Pan's Labyrinth, so... I think it's something about war or something. No, like about allegory. This Pacific, oh yeah, it is during the Spanish Pacific Little War. Rim, and it's about eating out a eating asshole and a, and a, a, a Hawaiian girl's oh, asshole. Okay. That sounds pretty cool. Yeah. I would like that, whether it was a movie or just a th- an Those activity I got to do. Del Toro, right? Did he? Yeah, he made Pacific Rim. Pacific Rim goes yeah. off. I forget that. Yeah, that movie rules. How about Gay Queermo Del Toro? That's good. Yeah. Gay Queermo Del Homo. That's very good. Wow. Ryan Ryan shut my roommate is uh roast battling uh Adam Guillermo del Toro? No, Adam Amawala and oh. I told him he should he had joke he should use is call him Adam Gay Koala. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good one, dude. <laughs> Ryan's gonna win that roast battle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I call him Adam Gay Koala, be like, What are you sucking uh, eucalyptus flavored dicks? You fucking gay koala. <laughs> That's a good roast. You're really bad at roast jokes, dude. Huh? You can only do self-deprecating humor. You're bad at roasting. I don't like... Yeah, I'm not good at roasting. Yeah. I mean, I had a couple okay ones. You're good at roasting. I'm okay at it. Yeah. Yeah. 
You're Stop fine at wrestling. Up on stage and they're like, "Stop that!" And Stop's like, "Ladies, I love chocolate." <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, is that a roast joke? <laughs> Um, I don't like roasting because I'm not a mean guy. I'm a cute. I'm a nice boy. You know. You you uh you're good at roasting, like doing crowd work roasting. That's true. Yeah. If it's if it's in the moment, if it's if I'm you're pretty it. good at funny moms last week. Yeah, that, that, that drunk was insane. That drunk woman. If you're out there, holler at me. You're my wife. Yeah, honestly, I thought you're you're in a smash. Afterwards. I already, I did. Yeah, I fucked you six times. <clears throat> So that's nice. that. The classic six time fuck. <laughs> One fuck for every bullet in the gun. The machine gun fuck, dude. Do, 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 do. Um, boys, I never really gave you guys the rundown from Greece, man. Don't you guys want to know about my ma- no, magical trip? No, you tried to trip? do it three times and we've gotten bored. So I don't know if Okay, that's well, guess what, bitch? I'm not saying anything anymore. Well, that's that. You know, yeah, I had notes so and everything. Tell us a story about George, you know. No, it's not about buying George. shoes. He never bought shoes, so. You yeah. know, and I haven't seen you open a beer with your gifts, by the way. Adam kept shoving that thing in his mouth. <laughs> it's well, a I just have an oral fixation. <laughs> beer opener, and he's sticking the dick. I don't know in what you mouth. mean, little no. dick shaped. I think it was. You said literal. Oh, I think it was pretty average slash small. Slash, a- average slash colors large. too. That's what a normal <laughs> dick looks like. Yeah, like a seafoam green dick. Yeah, like oh, a yeah. phoenix rising from the ashes. Yeah. Like Ray Sharkey's Phoenix Dick. <laughs> Shouts out Ray Sharkey. He's the real ass dude of the week. <laughs> <laughs> He's the real ass dude. Who's making those songs for Lewis? I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah, we need somebody to make a a song for a thing I say in the middle of the <laughs> yeah, show. Yeah. Not the theme song of the show. Just I feel th- like Lewis is really good at mobilizing people to do work for him for not a lot of money. Yeah. Like graphic design work and like... I production work pays people well yeah but I, I, I feel like he has like a dead he's good Lewis, at Lewis is, Lewis is definitely good about paying people but he's not charitable there's a difference between the two. yeah oh, interesting sure. I pay people and I'm charitable like I give you guys money for shit that I should like what advertising income all right, come on we get we should get advertising income yeah well I mean yeah, certainly s- not the split that it is we're selling our asses too yeah. you know I want to do a read. I get, twice I get, a, I get week. a cut of all the money that Adam brings. In. Well, Adam doesn't touch any of the money. Yeah, when he I goes out on the up. street, the money comes to me. <laughs> yeah, you got to He got He's got to kick up. Yeah, <laughs> his pimping ain't easy. Where's his taste? I'm sorry, Daddy. <laughs> yeah. Daddy needs his taste. Thanks, Thanks Daddy. Daddy. Don't call me that. Thanks for protecting me, Daddy. Thank you, Papito. <laughs> it's dangerous Thank out you, on papito. these streets. Yeah. Did you watch the pimp show yet? Which what one? The uh, James Franco pimp show? No. No, I'm not watching that show. All right. Yeah, everyone keeps asking it me looks to like shit, review dude. the good. autistic doctor show. How, why Which, does it look like shit? I don't know. It looks weird. What do you mean weird? It doesn't look good. What the fuck do you want me to say? Yeah. Oh, those, period, what do you mean? Those, like, those period drama. Yeah, it's cheesy, dude. Recent. No. What, is it, what's the, what are those called? Not, it's they're good. They're not period dramas, but like Mad Men or recent history period drama. Period dramas. piece. Yeah, it's, it's a period, a period drama. Uh, I feel like that look has they, does look they cool. have worn that out and now, I have an like, affinity, now the trick doesn't work anymore. I have an affinity for anything that's set in like shit New York. Like 1970s, like when it looked bad. Yeah, that's cool. I, I, I mean, like that. Everyone that, that, that. That always gets cool. me. That's not cooler. I think that always gets American me. Hustle was the movie that sort of Ugh. broke. American Ugh. Hustle that. sucked. That movie sucked my cock yeah. hard. I liked it, but I mean, I think well, I How did you like that? It. it sucked. Because it's a movie about con artists, and it's a movie that does everything it can to con the you The mafia should have killed them at the end, or whatever. I don't remember, but I, <laughs> <laughs> I remember I had a big issue with it. They got off scot-free. They would have gotten got. Now, what's good about American Hustle is that it's a bunch of bad performances... Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, that's why I didn't like it. It looks like shit, and it's a gimmick, but that's like the, kind of the whole point. They're con men, and the movie itself is a con. Yeah, listen, I don't want to. I don't need the whole movie to be making a point. You know, that's too much for me. That's I want to enjoy myself is. while it's going on. The biggest, the biggest play in the movie isn't like you know the heist with the chic or whatever. It's it's when you get to the end of the movie and. You let a bunch of critics tell you that Jennifer Lawrence is a good actor. Yeah. <laughs> she did the have the ultimate n- rube as you, the viewer, you know, and the critics that fell for it and said that movie was good. She did because have it's not good. If you're a critic and you think it's good, you're an idiot. You're a fucking moron for yeah. sure. But him, them titties were looking juice. She's hot dude. In, the, in that movie. Although I got pissed she off. She had him bouncing. I got pissed off that when scene I read where uh, she's dancing and singing and the like improv to Klaus cleaning scene. 
is one of the most embarrassing things I've ever seen. <laughs> well, just being an actor is pretty embarrassing. It's pretty embarrassing, but they're like, yeah, she totally improv that. I'm like, yeah. It's, it's not surprising. Stupid. It's a fucking jarring yeah. scene. <laughs> we improv this podcast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're it, actors. It, it looked like she was acting like a fucking asshole on the set, <laughs> and you just let her go. You know? Yeah. She really is too famous. Uh, I just, I don't like her because, uh, this is a pretty misogynistic reason, but after the fappening leak, her, like, official statement what? pissed what? You're, me off. You're against that she didn't want people to see her fucking titties against her will? Yeah, she's an actress, dude. That's rude, dude. She sells her titties all the time. No, but on her terms. Whatever. I It's not never the biggest s- deal in the world. Uh, that's all I'm saying. All right, leak a picture of your cock. We're talking... Uh, we've leak talked a about picture this- of your cock. Right now, tweet I'll a do that. It's fine. Well, I, I I'm do an feel she got treated unfairly because passengers, which I've defended on the show before, yes, you have. She was bitching about not getting paid as much as men, so she got like 20 million or some fucking outrageous number for that movie, like seven million more than Chris Pratt. Oh damn! And then everyone was like, "This is the worst movie that anyone's ever made." <laughs> well, that's why. No, I mean, the guy we talked about the um, we talked about it off mic maybe but the guy that did the fappening got like 15 years yeah in jail it's fucked up insane that I mean, is so long to go to jail yeah and you can't jerk off in jail 15 you'll be, years you'll beat the shit I out mean of you shouldn't steal people's fucking titties and pussies and put them on display that's not for why everyone. you got 15 years it's cause you got 15 years violating for apple, humiliating apple's apple and, security protocol yeah. really yeah. Yeah. yeah that's why he got it which is a point I already made to Adam, but now he's going to just talk over me. <laughs> stated as his own opinion. All right, sorry. I won't talk again. I'm sorry. Thank, you can thank talk. God. Just don't repeat something that I told you. Well, that's why, obviously, why he got punished. It. Oh, so you invented that? Yes, I did. You're the first person to say I that? I am the first person to say that. <laughs> no, it's just a fact. Is it a fact? Some may say a tidbit. We're a entering tidbit. Adam's fact corner. <laughs> this is, tell us more about the... The... the, the I'm know. paleo again. What? Sorry. <laughs> I'm being yelled at about the cat going through the garbage. Yeah, Phyllis is eating your, your ham garbage. Phyllis is a bum. I didn't put any ham in There's it. ham juice all I over. I ate all my fucking ham. Is there any more ham? I'm hungry. No, dude. Can I, I hate it all. I get, I get, I get the organic. Uh, you do the Applegate ham. Applegate ham. Ooh, I dice yeah, that shit. Big dick soldier. I over put that here. in my breakfast, <laughs> Mister <laughs> Fucking Organic Ham. Well, that's uh, what they have at the that's store. That's the only shit they sell at the store. Yeah, actually. really. Yeah, yeah, the bodegas here is this like cross section of like the lowest know, garbage grade. shit, yeah, and yeah. then like you know. Uh, free range yogurt <laughs> for nine dollars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. And it's dusty for some reason on the packaging. Yeah, yeah. yeah what dude, the fuck? Yeah, it. this fucking seltzer I just bought is like covered in dust. <laughs> Adam loves eating dust. Yeah, he's a fucked up bug. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck out of insult? Is that? <laughs> You're a fucked up bug, dude. Bug. You're a ladybug with a <laughs> fucked up face up front <laughs> and not enough spots. Yeah. Dude, there's way too much has. red. You got ladybug. one spot. <laughs> Ladybugs do Everyone calls you, they call you the Indian ladybug. You got made fun the of. The reverse Indian. <laughs> <laughs> One black spot on your red body. <laughs> are, there, are there guy ladybugs? Yeah. That's you gotta are. suck, dude. You Everyone are. thinks you're a girl. Yeah. That's what you are. They probably all have gender dysphoria. That's my new Jerry Seinfeld observational bit about ladybugs. Mm. Sorry, I tried to work that into the show this week. Is that a What's real bit? What's the deal no, really? with trans people? <laughs> you can't cut your dick off. <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> you sound like the guy from uh, the SNL yeah. Yeah, intro. Pardo. Here's me, Jerry Horatio Seinfeld. Sims. Don't cut your dick off. That's crazy. <laughs> What's his name? G- Pardo? Don Pardo. Don yeah. Pardo, yeah. Mm-hmm. He's, okay. a, he's a... Your dick's supposed to be permanent. <laughs> my dick's like that tag on a mattress. <laughs> you don't know why you can't cut it off, but you can't. <laughs> Musical guest, Hoobastank. 
Nice. Yeah, that's a nice try. That's a good. No, I thought that I did better. Who are your nice favorite announcers? I think like my I think my impression was actually better than yours. I'm not doing. You an do most. You do I'm most. Doing impressions Jerry Seinfeld. Seinfeld. He's doing Seinfeld. Oh, and it's spot doing on. Don Pardo. No, you said and his, that. That's Jerry how this whole. Hold on. The <laughs> this started by you making fun of him by saying it sounds more like Don Pardo. Now you're claiming I you thought, thought that we transitioned he seamlessly into Don a Don Pardo, Pardo thing. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't sound like him at all. I thought that sounded pretty Daryl good. Daryl Hammond is now the fucking announcer because Pardo kicked the fucking. Yo, apparently Daryl Hammond. Hammond, Hammond that, there's a guy who's got ham in his name. That's true. Daryl Hammond apparently Ham. his life is like yeah. real as shit. Else? Um, Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hamilton. Alonzo musical. Hamburger Jones. No. No. What, hamburger? No, dude? because no. It, that's it, that's actual word ham. It doesn't make sense. Come on, man. What do you mean? It Come does, on, man. You know why ham, it doesn't it's the work. Word hamburger. You know you understand why it doesn't his work. Name <laughs> is, <laughs> his name is not the hamburger. criteria that we that's were just not, doing. That's his nickname. fucking nickname. If oh, I was named okay, fucking so we, we Pam have to do Dick Christian. Jones. Okay, sorry. I didn't know not we had to Christian do our fucking name. Christian. Because mo- you're saying fucking stage names probably for most Hamurabi, of those guys. Hammurabi. Some, some guy named Hamurabi. They got there Hammurabi's code. That's not an actor. Who said it had to be actors? That's what we were doing. Just keep just up, now. Adam, all right? Me and Nick are doing a great bit where we're naming people oh who God. have ham in their name. <laughs> okay? And you're dragging us down, brother. Why are you I think trying Alonzo? to ruin the show, dude? Okay? I'm just, I'm, we're not even being mean to you a- anymore. Right. We stopped, we stopped being that. mean to you, and you're actively trying to derail the show by... You this. called me a ladybug who eats dust. <laughs> <laughs> I that said was a compliment. Up, you fucked up. I, I said was, you were lady, bud. Yeah, we were just trying to name That's a compliment. That you are. Well, then thank you. I'm, it's not an insult to say what you are. Dude. Yeah, that is what you are, literally. I'm not a bug who eats stuff. That's a lady bug. That's a mean thing. That's there's a fucking little gas bug. <laughs> we're just holding a mic up to its mouth, and that's what you're. That's what you guys are hearing talk right I'm now. I'm not a bug. I'm the tallest <laughs> cum boy. I tower over you. Both you of ta- you. You don't tower over shit. That's why the anger. You the tower over the Napoleonic dust anger that I get from you guys. Whatever, dude. From down Napoleon. in your... Down in... I will... I'm f- up here in the troposphere. Me and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar and... You're short and ugly. I'm not short and ugly. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> I'm tall and <laughs> handsome. Nope. And I get more attractive every year. And every you year definitely, you get you fatter and balder. I get he back. actually hasn't gotten fatter and balder. He's been the same the bald same since probably the last been, three years. Yeah. <laughs> and he's gotten less fat. Thank you, Nicholas. Well, I got fatter, but I've lost half the no weight choice. I gained. You're ugly. You've always been ugly. You always will be ugly. That's not true. You haven't known me my whole life. I was way I've ugly. I've seen pictures. You were fucked up looking. I was butt ugly. I know. And now I'm cute. You're and not now, that cute. Now you can't name things with ham in them. Yeah, I dude. said Alonzo Hamburger. Oh, show. my <laughs> God. Dude, we got, we, I don't know how many times we're going to have to fucking correct This is you fucked this. up, dude. You're really Any, pissing anyhow, me the fuck off right now. We need to move on from this. <laughs> <laughs> we did. Yeah, we man. were trying to have a fun game to oh, kill time with, and you fucking ruined it. <laughs> Let's see how long we can do. I mean, we were kind of running dry, honestly. I, I I went for Hammurabi. Yeah, I think that the getting mad at me thing stretched John it out. Ham no, I'm something. tired of doing that. Anthony Hamiltop. Okay, that's the guy. Who's that? Anthony Hamilton. Shut up, dude. That's the not singer, a person. Black singer. Is. Yeah, he is. We already said Hamilton. Uh, so, if people keep asking me to review the show with the autistic doctor, that's which a show? I'm not going to do. Which show is that? Uh, there's a show now where it's like that Toby from the West Wing is like, yes, he may be retarded, but he's the best doctor I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and it's like, you know, he's Doogie Hauser, but he's, yeah, you know, he's got, he's got he the mind child? of a child. Yeah. <laughs> Doogie Hauser MR, that's what I was calling it. <laughs> MR stands for mental retardation. In that's the, good. In the medical community. Yeah. Um, instead of Doogie Hauser MD, which is okay. the name of the original Doogie Hauser show. Yeah, yeah. You would think there would be an easier Doogie Hauser pun. Doogie seems like it rhymes with a lot of stuff, but it doesn't. Doogie, bo- sort of boogie. Amtrak Hauser? No. Mm, Amtrak? Am- some train related. Yeah, yeah, because he's retarded. Oh, he's, 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 he's yeah, retarded. He's that, so the autistic doctor, he only delivers babies in elevators. <laughs> okay, that's good. Go. Okay. Go. 
That's a joke you could do about that show. <laughs> you want to go ahead and repeat that to your friends, maybe? What uh, network is it on? Let's talk, you know, it's probably business. Is it on, like, a major network? Yeah, it's on, like, CBS or ABC. Oh, that's Autism nice. is huge right now. Everybody wants to have a show where Big an Bang autistic theory. guy does something not autistic. We, we remember when we were hanging out with those girls when we, when we first moved here? And that girl told us about that show she auditioned for. Oh yeah, that dumb, that <laughs> fucking dumb bitch. Dude. I, and I'm not trying to be a misogynist. No, here, but, but she's what a stupid, a dumb, bitch. fucking bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know. I mean, in like, a non-misogynistic a dumb bitch, way, that's her. <laughs> yeah, you know, yes. Just come up with one in your head. I've got that's one. That's who this one. Yeah. Oh my god. Actually, yeah, I'm just in town for auditions, and this as this show's really cool. It's like uh, she, there's it's about an autistic guy that can talk to ghosts. Oh, I thought it was an autistic yes. girl that could talk to ghosts and then solves crimes. I don't know, dude. She's like a precog or something. She solves crime. I don't know. It sounded like the worst thing ever. She's like, yeah, I think it's the power really- of being autistic. Yeah, to talk yeah. to ghosts. Are they are they autistic ghosts? I think it sounds sh- like a pretty good show. Actually, <laughs> I would watch this show. <laughs> well, like, like what about being we were- autistic? I don't or know. Or is that just a coincidence? It, the, her autism gave her some what sort if of Superman, supernatural what powers. What if Superman was retarded? Hmm? That's Well, there is a retarded Superman. His name's Bizarro. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, yeah, Remember yeah. Remember Bizarro? Yeah. No. Bizarro's really funny. Bizarro is like... <laughs> Uh, he looks fucked up. Yeah, 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 he's like different, different mm-hmm. planet. And he yeah, literally and he does shit a, like that. Like literally a mentally retarded yeah, Superman. Yeah. That's he true. wears like a pendant around his neck that says number one. Yep. <laughs> 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 yeah, the little other, the little alien guy, Mister Magazigazig or whatever. Yeah, Mister Mixapixelix. Or yeah, something. yeah. Mister Six. Yeah, that was a good ass show. That was Superman. The Superman show <laughs> yeah. with Dean Kane. No man, Which that Superman? one was good too though. No, it's Terry the- Hatcher could. I oh, get that was it. yeah. Terry Lois Hatcher and Clark was dab. Yeah, uh, the Superman show that was like the same as the Batman yeah, yeah. animated series. Oh, the, that was yeah, really animated. good, man. Yeah. They got a couple of the movies. Batman animated series used to be super dark. It was like he was like sad yeah, all the time. Bye, yeah. Amber. Bye, Amber. What are you doing? Have a good night. In my dick wet. Nice, dude. Oh, Hell nice. Yeah. Oh, She's gonna hell fuck. yeah. <laughs> I love when my boys fuck. Yeah, uh, what, I'm not really into Batman or Superman or any of that uh, yeah, quote-unquote gay shit, <laughs> which I don't call it that. Other people, other bad guys say that. <laughs> Me, I'm open-minded, but uh, I've heard, I, in passing, I've heard, uh, while I'm riding the train around, I've, I've heard yeah. comic books be referred to as quote-unquote gay shit, which you yes. I find... You've heard it in like in large hallways when the echo of you screaming yeah. the words "gay shit" yeah. comes and back really, to you. And really, really, when I was cool doing the get it. kicked out of every New York library challenge, <laughs> going from one library to the next, calling the anime gay, <laughs> <laughs> going into the anime section. So it's on record that I think anime is gay at every yeah. library in New York. So no one can. Accuse me of secretly watching. So if you, anime. yeah, yeah, if you, if someone finds some accidental anime yeah. on your laptop, if somebody finds my a Netflix instant queue, which is filled to the brim with anime. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking Ghost in a Shell. We're talking um, fuck Naruto. Yeah, the Ghost in the Shell listens to Come Town, huh? Scarlett Johansson, shout out. Our yeah, fans, oh yeah, our fans. Scarlett B- Johansson, huge shout out. We fought. We all fucked out. her. I think. I don't remember. Don't talk boring. about her that way, stuff. <laughs> Please do not talk about. It. I don't remember. Did we? No, we didn't. F- no, we yeah. didn't fuck Scarlett Johansson. I, somebody got mad at me because I told I just a story want Scarlett about this to know guy. that I'm standing up for her right now. This guy that had a, a a fucking poster of the Notebook above his bed in his dorm at GW because he had a crush on Rachel McAdams. But it's like that's not the fucking. Yeah. movie you pick mm-hmm. dude There's also so- don't have a poster in your room what are you like a fucking 14 year old girl you see he wasn't a put dorm cool shit people up in, in college have posters like, though like, uh, like tools? they have the Bob Marley poster they have the yeah, yeah, Reservoir yeah, yeah, yeah. Dogs yeah, yeah. someone poster. who listens to the show said that they couldn't listen to the show anymore because that was their friend they just <laughs> happened to know the guy he was my, my friend's roommate and I made fun of him and I think I mentioned his name guess what Good fucking riddance. Yeah. Whoever's yeah. not listening, suck these fucking low hanging balls. We have literally hundreds of Adam has listeners. some low hangers. You've seen them? I've seen your nuts. Oh, when I bent over. You know what's yeah. really sad about when I lost my phone? My phone that got st- stolen in Baltimore. I had a beautiful video of, of your my balls. Ass. 
yeah. and I wanted to edit together. Oh, you got to use iCloud, baby. I am yeah. now. I am now. But. I use iCloud. And then I can get fapping. My brand new Mac died. Bullshit. Ten months. Fucking logic board failed. Did you get a new one? Nope. No, I got to buy Apple Care because they just replaced the board and all the shit in there. And, uh, I mean, I'm assuming it's going to happen again because they make shit computers. No, they make good ones. You're the only Dude, person my, I've ever heard in my life have this Dude, problem. My, my, literally, every, my every shit has lasted since 2009. I had that Toshiba. I got it for $700, and it's lasted years. It's slow as fuck. It's heavy. It's like uh, you can't take it anywhere. Yeah, it's like 20 pounds. Yeah, but, I mean, it, like that computer will never die. Yeah, I don't know. And man. I edit every show on it. Really? Yeah, I tried editing. When I was editing the audio for... Uh, 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 the the soundboard. Yeah, the soundboard. The fucking Mac died. Hmm. You know, just crashing, restarting. Mm, that sucks. I want to buy one. I want to buy uh, a Mac. You I get can't a Mac, have dude. this. I'm a professional a app developer. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> well, you got the, the regular Steve. Imagine if Steve Jobs were still alive. I I shoot him an email. I say Steve. Fellow innovator here. Yep, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm designing a Imagineer. soundboard app where my friend says things like Billy Joel and <laughs> whatever. Man, this shit's Fava boring. Beans. Beans. <laughs> when did I say Fava Beans? By the I way, don't know. <laughs> why did you say it that way? I have no idea. It's so weird. It was actually pretty cool, dude. I pulled your audio from one episode, and that was I, all one I episode. It, it was, I, yeah, I brought it into Logic. And then if in logic you can uh strip silence and set like the thresholds and mm. like where how much of it cuts and then it it just uh it just separates the entire your like track for the show into individual words. Ooh. Yeah, or like individual statements. Little so That's fun. Yeah, then I could just go through all of them and I don't have to listen to all the fucking silence. It was actually yeah. pretty easy to pull all that shit. But yeah, I don't know what the fuck you were talking about or why you kept saying <laughs> fava beans. <laughs> Because you said it multiple times. <laughs> really? Yeah. Hilarious. A but, cupcake and a candy bar. I'm sure there's a listener out there that's like, episode 52, minute yeah. 11. In episode 4FOB, Itchy <laughs> hit Scratchy's rib cage twice, producing two completely different notes. I mean, uh, what are we supposed to believe? This is some sort of <laughs> magic xylophone? <laughs> oh, fuck, man. I gotta take a piss. You guys handle this without me. It's, oh, it's, I don't know if we can. Dude. It's rolling. It's pretty Are we doing rolling a spot right on now. This? This, is, this is the regular episode. This is the regular episode. Well, you know what? I'm telling you, fucking pieces of shit about Greece, whether you want to hear about it or not. Man. I no, think because there's topics that we have to cover. We like, can get what? to the Greece list. thing at the end. Hold on. God damn it! What oh, do we have fuck. to cover? Oh, Nick's precious list. I didn't make a list this time. Oh, I thought well, you were. Then what the fuck topics up? do we have? To we cover? have to cover. Uh, what hurricane Maria. Earthquake. Is there another hurricane, hurricane in Mexico Irma. City? Uh, yeah, there's an earthquake in Mexico City. Oh, damn. Do you see that video that, people are dead. that building really? collapsing? I do not watch videos of Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> you know that about I me. hope the tacos are okay. Well, you know that I Yeah, have. me too. <laughs> <laughs> Bong, Taco Bell. <laughs> Yo quiero Taco Bell. That's what I have to say about the earthquake. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Good thing we Moving fucking on. checked that one off. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Remember that yeah. Chihuahua? Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Hell yeah. I wonder how I could speak like a Mexican American. Yeah. I wonder if anyone's made the observation that all these natural disasters, it's kind of like the world's ending because of Donald Trump. Oh, <laughs> you know? that's something. It's like Mother Nature's pissed off or something. Folks. Yeah, well, Mother Nature's a woman and she doesn't like getting yeah. her pussy grabbed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. By those, uh, hey, by those little hands. And what I like, yeah. what I like to think Cheeto. is happening is that Cheeto the, the world is imploding Cheeto. because people are criticizing. Uh -huh. The president. That's right. The only person they don't have respect for the office from Kim Jong Un. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from a guy addicted to cheese. Yeah, is he? <laughs> yeah, he's addicted. What kind of cheese? Emmental Swiss cheese. <laughs> yeah, dude. Is that good? Is no, that good cheese? He got gas. Like he almost killed wins. himself. He almost killed himself with cheese. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Respect. <laughs> yeah, stop. You Respect. should actually be like. Uh, I think no. You joke? should be standing up a little bit more for your no brother. joke. I could hang Kim with Jong. Kim Jong Un. He's a hoop head. He loves basketball. Yeah. My man almost killed himself off cheese. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's... Yeah, yeah. I love that, It's like dude. if you ran a country. Dude, if I ran a country, I would definitely have died. That's gotta be... You'd be wearing those, be like, some, uh, some those pile of the pl CIA passes. planning on how to fucking that's exploit true. that cheese thing. Yeah, oh, oh yeah. yeah. You gotta get in with the cheese. Yeah. You think he got to fuck that assassin that wore the LOL shirt? 
Uh, he killed his cousin or whatever. Yeah, maybe that'd be cool. Yeah, that'd be get all the right. fuck assassins. That video is insane. It is really wild. Like the spray yeah, and the LOL T-shirt. How do you want to get assassinated? Um, so like James Bond style. Borax in the dust it eats. <laughs> <That's dust. laughs> a raid ho- a raid again he wanders in he wanders in a, a, a nice what? little tin can that smells nice but he gets in there and his feet are stuck to the ground and he can't move <laughs> so correct me if I'm wrong you guys are saying in this bully, a that giant, I'm a, that a I'm giant a plastic uh, <laughs> fucking fly swatter gets you, dude. Uh, fly you swatter, yeah, that happens. Paper, and you can't move. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, a fucking chameleon fucking yeah. sticks his yeah. tongue out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God damn it. You guys didn't even do the one about the light. I see a light. And I'm yeah, like, yeah, it goes. Zzz. Yeah, and I guess. Shut zapped. up, dude. Stop trying to participate. Well, I'm just trying to help you rip. Bugs can't talk. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Did you know they made a movie about Adam's life? <laughs> it's, it's called, called The Bugs Life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Obviously. He's he's in that movie James and the Giant Peach, but it's a different version where James fucks the bug. <laughs> <laughs> in that peach yeah no yeah that was a, yeah I know thanks man <laughs> lit his ass up dude ra ra ka 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 fucking bug <laughs> you fucking bug nerd dude <laughs> you're a fucking bug bitch <laughs> <laughs> the best burn of all time <laughs> this is like <laughs> what did we call him last time a baby <laughs> We called him a baby The baby Yeah that was funny And then what else There was something really stupid A couple times ago I don't know Dad I was, cares uh, Fuck Adam He's yeah. a bug Yeah I'm a bug Get your fucking uh, Antennae off me bitch <laughs> Yeah yeah He's sending chemicals out To the other men bugs He's doing dances at them To tell them where his asshole is <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Ah, oh boy. I'm just gonna like do a tweet tomorrow about like, oh, uh, like Trump or something. And then yeah, get a bunch of RTs. All these kids are gonna be like, oh, I don't know, bugs can tweet. <laughs> <laughs> Good. They just do yeah, everyone do that at Adam. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that's happening. Dude. Every time Adam tweets, please respond. I didn't know bugs could tweet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, fuck! Uh, I love being with the damn boys, man. Yeah, I mean, it was, you, I made a big fat good. fucking steak today, dude. I, I saw that steak. I think you're exaggerating how big that steak was. I cut it in half. Oh, how how much did it weigh? <sighs> I go always a pound at least. It was a pound and a pound and like one point two or something like that. That's good. It was a twenty dollars steak. They're bone in, huh? A little bit of bone, not a lot. No. Small bone. Ribeye? Ribeye. What ribeye the fuck? ribeye the is, the, is the only kind of steak. If, they have yeah, nice marble Unless you're going to fucking season the shit. If you're going to season it, you can get whatever. Nah, dude. You need no, that ribeye fucking is the fatty best. shit, dude. Ribeye is the I best, don't. but I mean, I, when I, you know, I, you I don't, can get away with I don't, a different I need cut. leaner cuts. I can't eat a pound of steak. I don't like fatty. filet that much. It doesn't fit my macros. Filet can suck my f- dick. But filet is like supposed to be the nicest one. No, that's bullshit. That's filet the way mignon? people say fucking chicken breast is the get that dry you shit out of my No, you, you can take make any chicken, chicken breast well. sucks my dick. You thigh just, number one. Right. Well, thigh is better. I yes, agree. Chicken, how, let me put it this way: chicken fucking sucks. And I'm saying that as someone that eats chicken constantly. That's not true. Chicken thigh is good. It's I went to Popeyes boring, the other dude. day. Chicken got is all just fucking boring. Thank you, brother. Yeah, that's my. That, got I a love five that. piece. Five. Five piece. Yeah, yeah. Me and Max. Five thighs. I love it, bro. Pretty good. I love that. Yeah. Um, that makes me happy. But drumsticks, shit. delicious. Thighs, right? I mean, it's fatty. That's no, why it no, tastes no. good. The, the fucking thing above the drumsticks drum are the same meat. It's, it's the same type dark of meat. meat. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't know. A drumstick feels like a little too yeah. cute to me. You know what I miss? Having uh, sex with men. That day we had the uh, no. At the, <laughs> the, the day we went to Amish market. Oh, what a beautiful day that you was! You bring man. it up all the time. It was it was the one of the best days of my, one of the best fucking mornings of my life, dude. Yeah, yeah. I went to that Outback Steakhouse so with good. my friend for his 18th birthday right before he shipped out to the Marines. Nice. Yeah. Is he alive still? 
Uh, yeah, he got blown up in Iraq. Damn. And then he was in Fuck. Walter Reed for a while, and then he married some fat woman, and now mm-hmm. he has a bunch mm-hmm. of kids, and he's an airplane mechanic. That, doesn't that happen? They assign you a fat woman in the army? Yeah, pretty much. No, you get home, and you marry, like, the first girl to ever jack you off. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, when you're like, oh, we rediscovered all their love from eighth grade. I came on her fucking jelly bracelet behind the movie theater, and now we're in love again. She's four. 400 pounds now, but you know what? I mean, I can't walk good anymore, and I lose my fucking temper real easy. But we're, we have a family. We have a big family now and everything. I'm sure he's a good dad. He seems like he would be. Yeah, all those people are better people than us, for sure. Yeah. I don't know I'm making fun of that guy. I wish I could have that kind of stability in my yeah, life. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Unfortunately, I, I being have a father to resign to great. being a millionaire. Yep. Just uh, uh, the busy life. You know, a lot of people think because I'm a tech a tech billionaire that I just live this jet set and lifestyle, but I actually have very little free time. Yeah. You know, between the gym and buying supplements and, <laughs> you know, fucking going yep, to Home making Depot. Making a ham scramble. Making a ham scramble. <laughs> trying to figure out how to make my own sconce. What's a sconce? Sconce is like a recess. Look how light. excited Adam was to tell <laughs> you what a knows. sconce was. <laughs> And it's not a recessed light. It's a light on the wall. It's not like a lamp. It's just a lamp on the wall. It's a lamp on a wall. (laughs) It's not recessed. Okay. It can be recessed. Like Adam's ass. His recessed (laughs) ass. Should I have an outside ass? I mean, your ass cheeks are convex. They're concave. Concave. Like your chest. How is that even? You've seen my butt. It's just dented in. Yeah, it's it looks like in. it looks like an upside down booster seat. <laughs> <laughs> That's what your ass looks like. Yeah, little you get you got arrested for letting little kids sit inside. It looks your like ass. yeah, it looks like an egg carton. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's some guy at the park trying to trick kids in, uh, into sitting on in his ass. <laughs> His dented ass. But your asshole is prolapsed. His fucking ass cheeks look like the a tampered with Snapple cap. <laughs> <laughs> and they fucking Adam gets they, fucked and his ass cheeks suck in. <laughs> well, pop. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Let me do the noise. Yeah, yeah. Do the noise. There yeah. we go. Yeah. Yeah. That's Which how you is, know. Adam's not fresh anymore. Mm-hmm. He has to get his ass. He's used up. Yeah. Well. He's used up, but you like can still like a Snapple cap. You can still use that boy pussy a little bit. Yeah, I and like a Snapple tidbits. cap. There's tidbits underneath. <laughs> you copy. Yeah, I was I was waiting for you to start to say it so I could intercept. <laughs> <take away from>. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking snatch that right out of your stupid bug mouth. <laughs> it's my th- thorax. <laughs> Snatched it right out of your web, bitch. Yeah. No, oh, that's another way you die. Wrapped up in a web yeah, <laughs> from a spider. by a, a Korean spider. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I got eight legs. <laughs> yeah, you come in my house, I eat you. <laughs> How dare you come in my house? My house made out of silk. <laughs> I ate legs. I feed you to baby. I ate my own husband. <laughs> Hell yes, <laughs> Korean spider baby. That's For, our new character. On I the love show, it. Dude. People wanted to follow up to retarded man that owns a Valero. <laughs> well, we also did retarded Elmer Fudd who thinks he's Dracula. Yeah, that's very really cool. Yeah, we got some good good shit, man. Yeah, I still have to piss. Let me know when I'm I have allowed. To pee too. You can go piss whenever you want. Do you want to cross swords? No. No, we need to. We need that to, would be so us though. We need to discuss. The hot, the hottest topic this week. What happened? So, I don't know. Some politics bullshit, probably. Oh, Sean Spicer at the Emmys. Oh, yeah. How about Sean that? Sean Spicer yep. at the Emmys. Fucking pieces of shit. It's fuck Sean retarded, Spicer. Dude. It's like the whole resistance thing is retarded, and it's like, how the fuck is Adam Baldwin going to kiss him on the cheeks? Adam Baldwin's a conservative. Is he? Alec Baldwin? Alec Baldwin? Did? No. Yeah. No, he's... Oh, I thought you said Adam Baldwin. <laughs> Animal that... mother. Huh? Animal mother. Is that another Baldwin that I don't know about? Adam Baldwin from fucking Full Metal Jacket. Oh, I don't... I, don't. I know Billy Baldwin. Yeah. No, Adam Baldwin is not one of the Baldwin brothers. Daniel... Ooh. Danny Baldwin is a conservative. Yeah, there's one that doesn't fuck with him. <laughs> yeah, Dan... I think Danny. The fat old one. 
I'm glad that motherfucker didn't meet the Pope. Fuck Stallone's brother is like that too. He's like radical right wing. Stallone is a conservative too. Is he? Yeah. Oh yeah. I, yeah. He just can't talk about it. Yeah. Uh, well, Frank does all the angry tweeting for yeah, Frank yeah, for a Sly. I want to rewatch Rocky, dude. I had a, a hanker and watch Rocky the other day. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. I watch Rocky. That movie's it's it's so much fun. Yeah, of I love course. It. It's an yeah. underdog story. It's a uh, he won uh, Academy uh, Award uh, winning screenplay. Uh, yeah, Adrian. Everyone says he sold his dog. Have you seen those viral videos about how Stallone like first he had to be in porn, which is hilarious. Softcore. Softcore. When he was sleeping at the Port Authority bus station. But I still think you see his cock. Do you? I'm pretty sure you see his cock and it's pretty big. Yeah. Uh but then he says he had to sell his dog. To like make rent at the YMCA or whatever. Who's buying a dog? Exactly. You but you just bought a dog, Adam. I didn't buy a dog. You paid five hundred dollars for your. No, I didn't. <laughs> I paid zero dollars. You paid zero. Yeah. That's what your dog is. Your dog is worthless to you. you so you got the shittiest dog that you could get. Dude, yeah. If I buy of course, a dog, so people feel bad. I'm gonna it. get a fucking th- forty forty thousand dollar dog. Such a waste of money. <laughs> no, it's a fucking purebred. They like it's only in fucked its years. family. I want. I want. Purebreds are only bad dogs. Ever fucked first. Yeah. Yes, but they're better than your dumbass dog. Why? Because they're fucking royal. Because there's some like Joseph Mengele, <clears throat> like yeah. Because someone beat them, off, beat off their dad, and and put the, and then spit the put spit the jizz in the with the mouth. Mm-hmm. That's the Immaculate Conception, by the way. That's how it happened. My friend Tommy, growing up, used the, to tell the me that the archangel sucked off God. And used to tell me that Mary's Alan pussy. Arvison was immaculately conceived. Who? My friend Tommy, growing up, he'd be like, "Yeah, Alan Iverson's mom, someone jizzed on her pussy, and then it got in it." That's not immaculate conception. That's not at all immaculate. That's conception. regular <laughs> conception. You fucking idiot. It's non-penetrative. Adam, Adam's coming from his stupid world of bug reproduction. <laughs> yeah. Where, yeah. Where, someone told me Alan Iverson's mom laid an egg. Yeah. And no one came and spread their jizz on it. Yeah. And then Alan was born. That's Adam, just. Adam I mean, I didn't believe it. Asexually. Mm-hmm. Where he has gay sex with himself it comes out of gay I mean, sex. I gay sexually. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I said it first. No, you didn't. Yeah, I said it before I you. I said it, and I set up. You the didn't joke, get the then, pun. Yeah, I, I did. did the pun no, first. You didn't. You yes, I did. You. No, you didn't. You I did it. But stop praying. Stop mantis. sucking up. He's not sucking. Yes, he's sucking. I were sucking up. That's a such a fucking. I'm not smaller. into your stupid nose. Your long nose. You get nutrients yeah. out of some <laughs> but hole in dried mud. <laughs> what fucking, a you fucking millipede! Yeah, that's why you got a, a fucking. Yeah, Adam has Adam has legs. a thousand arms, and none of them can reach his small ass dick. <laughs> They're all just trying to reach the dick. <laughs> and it's just curling up, and it's not working. A thousand arms, zero push-ups. This is like that Kafka book. The guy who sucked the at bug. podcasting. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, doesn't he turn into a beetle or whatever in that Kafka book? Yeah, uh, it he turns, turns into, into a fly. You fucking idiot. He turns into Adam. Oh, I didn't know he turned into Adam. Thank you, Nick. God damn it! What was the big topic we had to talk? Did about? Did something happen? I don't think there's a happened. new Obamacare repeal. <clears throat> that's probably it. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. What did you fucking quote tweet about it? I quote tweeted like. I can't even and got mm-hmm. a thousand RT. <laughs> it's pretty tight. Oh, I'm so man. glad I'm not on Twitter and I can just do things like worry about buying the best mattress. You didn't buy the best you mattress. You didn't buy no. it. You made a hasty decision. That's why I said worrying about it. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Why don't you just listen to things and parse sentences and think critically for Stav also made that mistake. He yeah, also didn't Stav understand. Stav is a dumb guy who lives in the moment and has a good Thank time. Thank you. I'm fine with that. Carpe diem. Yeah. That's my shit. I have a good I got time. that tattooed on my balls. I have my right time. ball's carpe, my left ball's diem, baby. Yeah. And your bitch sucks them all, sucks them both, Adam. Yeah. That sounds fun. What do you think of that? <laughs> Wait, you think it sounds fun? To suck yeah, it my sounds balls? like you're having a good time. I Adam am. lives on your balls like a mite. <laughs> like the yeah. honey, I shrunk. Oh the kids. no, do I have fucking pew? Do I have lice? Do yeah. I have crabs? Is Adam and his family on my balls? <laughs> <laughs> his whole family. <laughs> Rick Morena shrunk Adam's whole family. <laughs> They're just being bullied by that Korean spider. <laughs> Yeah, fuck you. 
Don't touch my house. You touch my house, I fear it. I fear it. I'll, I'll wrap you up. <laughs> oh, fuck. <clears throat> so I spent some time in Greece with my cousin Leonida. Finally. You brought this up already. He doesn't I never have a job. Finished. He, he lives with his tent. family. And he, he bartends and makes no money. Yeah, but they went on the episode we didn't air, you dumb motherfucker. Oh. And he fucks on he fucks in a tent. He's a grown man that fucks in a tent. To go like he goes outside his parents' like, house. That's to where fuck. he lives. In the summer, he doesn't rent a room. He rents a tent and he fucks tourists in What his kind tent. of tent are we talking about? Like a camping tent. You can't even stand up in it? No. It's hilarious. He's thirty two years old. And uh, he fucks in a tent. Maybe so, he should start a podcast. Dude, he, what he a bunch be, of dumb tourists. Yeah, dude. Imagine what kind of, what, who's doing that? Americans, just dude. fucking these dumb Any Australian accent. women. Yeah, yeah. Australians, they're like a, they're disgraced when they're on vacation. I explained to him uh, what Snapchat was. I was like, "Yeah, you take a picture and then it disappears." And he was like, "He was like, you should call me Leonida Snapchat because when I fuck, I disappear." Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah I, I fucked some girl from Denmark one time. Oh, nice, dude. the accent. And she's like, Yeah, I have not uh, fucked other... Uh, uh, this is only a time fuck American. Or whatever. <laughs> I'm like, wow. This- and you're like, please don't make eye contact. Yeah, it's like... This- I'm trying to come. the one you picked? That's yeah. Kinda- <laughs> I had sex with a German once. A German? Yeah, from Germany. Oh, yeah. Let's hear about Adam's story. Sorry, I didn't realize it was Adam's story time. <laughs> <laughs> Adam, what else happened? Yeah, what what happened, Adam? I don't know. So I thought make it was a joke about the Holocaust or Nazis or whatever. Go I ahead. thought it was kind of neat. Go ahead. What was neat it. about it? I don't know. Please explain to us. Yeah. We're all actually What's interested. neat about it? About having sex. Just as a European style of sex. What, in what sense? And that the girl penetrates the boy. <laughs> oh, fuck. God damn it. What was the top? I'm, I'm like losing my mind. I've destroyed this entire episode by not being able to remember the one thing. No, it's been fun. That I wanted to fucking bring up, which is, come on. I should have written being it down. Straight. Yeah, that's it. Hey, how about this? In dog beers, I've only had one. In dog beers? That's pretty good. It's pretty good, huh? Yeah. Th- I, I, I remember there was a kid with down syndrome that went to my community college that would wear a t-shirt <laughs> like a novelty t-shirt that said graduate spelled wrong and nice. then he's crossed off i've seen that and one and yeah and then that's a th- classic three or four times yeah but somebody bought that for him and it's like <laughs> yeah come on you know? <laughs> that's yeah. like buying adam a shirt that says female body inspector yeah because he's gay or Bugs Life shirt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Official official promotional merchandise from Ants, the movie. Yeah. I yeah, identify he's more with of that. an Ants guy than a Bugs Life. Of course. Guy. Yeah. That was the he's, joke. He's bootleg. I was waiting for you guys to make that. Uh, were no, you? you were waiting to go into your cocoon. <laughs> <laughs> to come out as a gayer bug. <laughs> 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 Guess what? You think you're a butterfly? You're a moth, bitch. Yeah. You're not even a sexy ass butterfly. Yeah, you're you're an ugly ass moth, moth eating dude. Eating people's fucking clothes. Yeah. Eating girls' clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> you could get a little clothes. attracted to fucking light bulbs, ass bitch. <laughs> 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 you're not out there frolicking on nice flowers like a fucking cool ass butterfly. <laughs> you're in musty ass closets. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Yeah. You're outside yeah, of a yeah. shack. <laughs> what? Hanging out around a light bulb outside of a shack. Yeah, oh yeah. You know, in one of those outdoor bathrooms. Mm-hmm. He's trying to take a shit. You're just on the wall trying yep. to be a leaf. Why do they smell like that? Like like old people. That's what mothballs are. You mean, why do you smell like that? Yeah. Yeah, why do we smell like that? <laughs> I don't know. Tell us. Eat? Why can like old people not <laughs> deal with that? Is there are your dust-based diet? <laughs> Jesus. That's true. That's the reason, bitch. God, God damn. I, I love that you're a bug. This is my job. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck. Can't wait to think of other bugs you are later in the episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, this one's bad, but it's good. Yeah, it's fine. Who gives a fuck, dude? I'm really happy. I can't wait till people stop listening. We can kill ourselves. <laughs> Yeah, same. (laughs) 
Oh, fuck, dude. Damn, over 100 people are dead now in Mexico. That's oh, yeah, one for fucked. every mattress company. <laughs> <laughs> By night, nearly 140 people have been killed across the country, including scores in the state of Morelos, close to the epicenter of the quake, and dozens here in the capital, <laughs> Mexico City. <laughs> but the figure was expected to climb, especially because rescuers were still <laughs> frantically they digging out. They don't do out, the LR thing. Uh, frantically digging p- out people trapped beneath mounds of rubble. <laughs> My name's Janice Bitch, Channel 7 News. <laughs> the earthquake hit shortly after 1 p.m. <laughs> about 100 miles from Mexico City. <laughs> it registered a preliminary magnitude 7.1 <laughs> causing heavy and prolonged shaking in the capital. <laughs> Capi- Capi- Italian. Capitalia. More than 40 buildings and other structurios in Mexico City Plaza, <laughs> including at least those schools, officials said, crushing cars and trapping some people inside. Uh, no Kira Taco Bell, said <laughs> emergency workers and ordinary citizens raced to the side. I always wish they would do that. The voice, the change thing, the code switch thing with like tragic stories and not like, yeah. you know, there was a parade and that's for why. stealing health care. <laughs> yeah. was, it was the fifth annual parade for, you know, getting a job outside of mm-hmm. Home Depot or I don't yep. know, whatever, yep. whatever. What was the one in Maryland called? The parade? Casa. Was Casa of Maryland the... Casa? Immigrant uh, outreach program. Oh, eh, I don't fucking know. Yeah. Uh, you know, as a white ethnic immigrant, people kind of like don't even consider us immigrants. Yeah. You know? You're a blimpigrant. Blimpigrant? <laughs> yeah. You floated over the border. <laughs> now, I would love to be a blimp, dude. Dude, they got it. I was reading them. every like. You go year, wherever the fuck once, you want. Once a year, I fucking. I fucking get really into the idea of bringing back Zeppelins. Because really, it was the Hindenburg that fucked it up for everybody. Right. So they didn't go that fast. They were using hydrogen, right? You know, they go or like something. 80 miles per a hour. A plane goes way faster. Yeah, well, the, the the reason the Hindenburg happened is because the United States was the only con- country that had helium as a lifting gas. Because we had a bunch of fucking helium caverns or whatever. Nice. So in the rest of the world, it was really expensive, or at least in the rest of the world where they manufacture Zeppelins. And they would use hydrogen, which was, like, extremely fucking dangerous. Flammable as as all dick. So they could do them with helium now. You could just make fucking helium zeppelins, and they would be safe and fine. Like the Goodyear blimp? Goodyear blimp. Yeah, any of them. Any rigid airship or non-rigid airship. You know, they use safer lifting gases. But we could be traveling. Boys, we could have a fucking zeppelin for the show. How much do you think that would set us back? $1.4 million. That's nothing. I've looked into it. That's nothing. We make that... We make... A full Twice size, that a full size on ads Zeppelin. alone, dude. We go up there, get a little Wi-Fi going, a yes. sauna. Ooh, you know. Yeah, how big is the little like place that You're people chill in? <laughs> You're not allowed on the blimp, so don't. Well, ask it's fine. Us. I can fly anywhere. No, you can't. Yes, I can. It's, it's gonna be too high. Not right? up. Not past. 10, 12 feet. Fine, something okay, like that. whatever. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. We'd be eaten by birds. <laughs> yeah, dude. We're going to have our fucking hawk around. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you want to be, you want to fucking tangle with him? Yeah, dude. You'll end Sick up, the bird on You're going to end up in his, my man's beak. Yeah. Yeah, we, Adam had to leave the show because he got eaten by a toucan. <laughs> 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 they confused his spotless body for a, a baby cherry. And he got eaten by toucan Sam. He thought he was fruit. Yep. The new cherry flavored fruit loop. <laughs> but it's actually Adam who's a ladybug, if you'll recall, initially is what we called him. <laughs> Talia Hernandez, twenty eight, was on the second floor of the building, taking a tattoo class. <laughs> when the earthquake hit and tore down through the structure, she said she rolled down the stairs as they were collapsing. She managed to escape the building but broke her foot. I can't believe I'm alive, she said. Weeping and in shock is oh, did you see that fucking bus crash in Queens? Yeah, that was yeah, fucked I up, saw dude. That. Brutal, dude. I was like, man, that is wicked. And then I find out, guess what? My man, the driver, he's Chinese. Chinese. Yep. Yeah, I know. Let's, <laughs> yeah. let's, let's hear it for the boy. <laughs> Three last two of the week, go the on. Chinese guy. <laughs> Fucking driving drunk. <laughs> oh yeah, sixty miles per hour and a fucked up off sake. Zone. Yeah, right. 
You know? Driving that fucking shitty Atlantic City bus. Yep. Can you imagine trying to go to Atlantic City and you die? God damn. <laughs> That's a sad way to go. Yeah. Well, uh, maybe you lucked out, you know? Yeah. You could have gotten much worse at Atlantic City. Have you been AC. to Atlantic City? Never been to AC. Have no. you? Never. You tried to get me to go once, like a yeah. year ago. Sam uh, Sam Pitchell was like going on a whim. I think, or maybe it was Racine going. Racine asked me the other day if I wanted to go. Yeah, Racine. I guess I'd go with Racine. Racine. Guy. I'd go with Racine. I mean, I grew up around that shit, so it's not that. I mean, it's got the beach there. I guess you that's different than Vegas, blood, huh? Yeah. No, I you just can't uh, go yeah, the back. The beach would be nice, dude. You can find a nice. God damn God it! Damn you're it. such a fucking idiot, dude. <laughs> is it? Is it okay? Why? Why don't you just not kick the recorder <laughs> off the table? <laughs> it, wasn't, it was an accident. <laughs> Did it fuck it up? No, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe. I'll fuck your ass if this if you fucked it up, bitch. Um, I think we're fun. Yeah, the beach would be nice, dude. You find a nice little shell to crawl into. <laughs> into your house. That's a hermit. Find crab. a new house for yourself. Yeah, congratulations, you just evolved, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> a little piece of trash, pet. <laughs> It'd get sold down at the boardwalk. Lobsters look like bugs, so you're also a lobster. Yeah. Yeah, they sort of look like bugs. They got exoskeletons. They are, they are literally a type of bug. Really? Yeah. So you are one, bitch. Mm -hmm. You're All Sebastian right. from The Little Mermaid, but gayer. Yeah. But -da 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 -da, Adam's a homo. -da 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 -da, <laughs> he sucks guys' dicks. Uh, <laughs> oh, I've HIV. Oh, I've HIV. <laughs> and don't tell anyone. Just like my sharky. I've HIV. <laughs> <laughs> Suck on my dick. <clears throat> Ariel, bad bitch. Jasmine, yeah, thank dude. you. You to Ariel or Jasmine? Adam's favorite princess. Is Jasmine Aladdin. had a pussy. That's true. Adam what, wants to say? sleep with Aladdin. <laughs> yeah. I identify with Aladdin. Aladdin. No, you're going to be dominated by his, that Muslim, <laughs> that magical <laughs> Muslim. <laughs> I used to, to think he was you. Jewish when I was a kid because he had the little hat. So I thought that. Oh well. Yeah, I was. You just wrong. have to take everything for yourselves. Huh? Well, yeah. you know, when you're a kid, you, you can't identify let any, with. You like, can't let any culture have anything. Whatever. Dude. I don't remember ever identifying with anything. No. No. Just, just uh. Fonzie I still don't have me. a sense of self. I feel yeah, like I, disembodied, noticed. sort of. Yeah, 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 I don't. I used to. You're like on ketamine all the time. Kind of. Yeah. Literally and figuratively. <laughs> I'm on ketamine. Have you ever taken ket before? Ketamine? Yeah, British club people love it. Yeah? No, one time I was doing... You know what British club people also love? Gay sex. That's true. Um, How would you know that, actually? Because uh -oh. I figured Whoa. that's what you were going to nah, say. you're spending time there. Have you been there? <laughs> In yeah. British you had club? gay sex with British guys? <laughs> yeah. You yeah? Have, do some buggering. You yeah. got buggered? Have a proper bollocking. You got, you got bollock? <laughs> yeah. Just, I love a nice proper bollock. Just get properly bollocked. <laughs> uh, I want to fuck a right fit bird. Yeah. I want to bugger a right fit bird. Shat, snog a... Snog a, a, a lass. Is that snog what a lass. That works, yeah. yeah. Snog a fat... Lass is more lass. like... Shut up. Scottish. <laughs> What do you? How do you say tits in British? Uh, tits. Muppers. <laughs> British women have huge tits. Oh, I want to suck some big meaty what? British tits. Where? How do you conclude that? Statistically, they have the largest cup size of any nation. Britain. I love it. I don't know that it that's does? true. Yep. Look it up. I want to suck some British big, women pale, have the biggest tits titties. in the world. How does that make any sense? What do you mean? How does it make any sense? Because a, There's it's companies a pretty that diverse manufacture. Country. Uh, bras. The largest bras are statistically shipped and sold mostly in. in, in I feel like I would say the United just States because we're, we're fat. Yeah. Well, you would be wrong. Britain. <laughs> I, I, I understand you would say the wrong answer. <laughs> okay, sure, but pull it you up. would be wrong. Pull it up. Pull up my dick. It doesn't make sense to me. I've already pulled it up. I know this for a fact. Yeah, dude. It, okay. Well, Why? it doesn't Just make because, sense. because, what, you flutter around closets eating bras all day long? You think okay. you know better? Yeah. In your, in your um, experience, when you've eaten bras in America versus England, what have been bigger? Adam? 
Adam's got to Google it now because he's so upset about possibly being wrong about something that he's never. Um, looked you into made before. a claim. I'm just trying to see if it's true or not, yeah. and it doesn't say. How do you say? How do you? How do you? Say, so what? Do you, what's a nice slang for titties in British? Adam. <laughs> I want to suck suck sucker Adams. Adams a tit, a tit mouse. Mm. I guess. <laughs> what the fuck was that damn thing I wanted what, to bring yeah, up? What, yeah, are you, are you doing a bit? I don't know what's no, going on No, there here. was like three or four things. That's why I didn't take notes, because I was like, oh yeah, these are big. We got to talk about this. I guess, I don't know, not North Korea. Who gives a shit? I don't really care about this earthquake. I mean, yeah, it sucks that people died, but... Yeah, that's bad. You know, I mean, there's been so many disasters recently. It's like, mm-hmm. you know, that's why you only have Christmas once a year. Yep. You know who doesn't get that right? The Jews. They do holidays every two weeks. Yeah. That's why nobody cares about any of their holidays. You're wrong. What do you mean? Who's I'm got wrong? the biggest titties? Russia, Finland, Sweden, Norway. No, nope. I looked it up. It was uh, it was in an article that I read that Britain ships the most of them. Russia, it doesn't make you, sense. It's an you're, incredibly and, diverse and, country. And you said it was America, so you went. Do you just look through all said these that. sources no, to I find said, the word Britain yes. is not the well, answer? Yes, and America on not... average has larger breasts than Great Britain. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. It's still you said America had the most. You did. I said it would make the most sense that America would because there's so many fat people. And Stav actually said that first. <sighs> you're fucking so you're is. fucking wrong, Nick. I'm not wrong. I'm, you're wrong. I'm, you're fucking snide. Fucking look down at you, fucking... Can you chill for a second, man? You're being kind of hostile right now. I'm being a bug right now, aren't I? Yeah, you're being a bugger. Yeah. You're the only bug that buggers other bugs. Why is ass fucking buggering? I I don't get that. Buggery. Why does it mean Now we're all looking at our phones. Yeah, no, because you can't just handle the fact that I stated something, and so you have to go find some other study... Which is wrong, by the way. <laughs> you pathetic. Nick commissioned to study himself. You're pathetic. You're, You're the one pathetic. that had to spitefully get your phone out because you can't score a single point this episode <laughs> with your shit little bug body. You said, oh, 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 something to contest. It's not our fault. We're literally a thousand you times of, larger you, than you yeah, as wait, humans yeah. versus a bug. Yeah, right. When earlier tonight you thought that a movie with Paul Giamatti in it was a documentary. <laughs> yeah, you did say. <laughs> what no. was it called? Yeah. <laughs> what was that movie called? It's a Too book. big to fail. He yeah, said, yeah, 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 he thought it was a documentary. Well, because it was a book. Actors in it playing. It was characters. a book. Yeah, that's never. Book. There's that was never adapted been. into. A movie. You know how Harry Potter is a documentary. That doesn't make it a documentary. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ! Harry Potter wasn't about something that happened. <laughs> yes, it was. So here are the countries with the biggest boobs ranked. Number one, U.S. Number two, Canada. According to who? Titties.com. Yeah, here's another article. Germany. Damn, there's two. You know what the only, the only answer is? Ladies of every... If you're listening, ladies in every country, send me pictures of Three your titties. Three U.S. non-Caucasian. And I will tell you. Four... U.S. Caucasian was one. Wow. U.S. non-Caucasian, three. Fat Four, Ireland. Titties. And you know what it is? It's milk, dude. Because we drink so much goddamn milk, they put hormones in it and make girls yes. have big titties in this country. Absolutely. That's my theory. I think you're right. Five, Poland. Six, United Kingdom. Seven, Nick. You're fucking wrong. All right, man. Are you happy? I'm happy. Yeah. Why? You needed that? Yeah, I needed it. All right. Well, I'll I have to now, after the show, go find the article that I read that said that because you want to go find... a. Counter study. There's three, <laughs> four, five other articles here that do no, not I say that, why the that fuck Britain has the care? largest tits. <laughs> I don't care. It's just the imbecile. fucking tone. Why the fuck what, do, what do you, you mean imbecile? So you're, you're wrong. Imbecile. You're being a child. You can't imbecile. admit that you're wrong. <laughs> I'm not wrong. I'm repeating a thing that I read that said Who Britain has the largest fuck? tits. We were talking about titties, dude, and you guys had to fuck it up with facts. I, you know what? I never wanted. Titties are a thing about joy, and they're a thing about just you know speaking from the cock and the heart at the same time. Yeah. And we're over here doing math about titties. Adam we're over here measuring to titties. Adam had to had to derail the show. I want his phone out, and he's shaking his head. He's all upset. I want to do is suck titties, watch them bounce up and down while I have sex. I was with trying the to remember the goddamn thing. That and I Nick had. is yeah. still working on that. You know, so let him figure that out. Figure out what. The thing we got to talk about. I, it's, the show's over. We already nice. Did the whole Have we done hour. an hour? Yep. Damn. There's yeah. a thing I was supposed to mail off tonight that I didn't do. What was it? I oh, don't worry about it. It's work related. 
Uh, dude, as as executive vice president of this company, it has nothing to do with the company. It has to do with my own personal <laughs> career. So, oh, nice. Tell it us. It doesn't affect you guys. You it affects me because you're pay. my friend. None of the money will go to you. It all goes to charity. <laughs> a lot of people don't know this. Nick donates a hundred percent of every paycheck to charity. I do donate a lot of my money to charity as a tax write off. Yeah, I consider not stepping on Adam to be charity. <laughs> And I spent all the money on, you know, their little lights sort of yep. on the floor. Buying right? him little leaves <laughs> for him and his family to eat. Yeah, right. <laughs> Don't bring my family into this. We have him living in a... What are you guys having for Thanksgiving? Two liter with some sticks in there. <laughs> yeah. You know how much he loves sticks. <laughs> are you guys going to have, like, palm trees? Palm leaves for Thanksgiving? It's is very like, funny. Is that like, uh... What's the best kind of leaf? What's your favorite leaf? I don't know. Fern. We should just <laughs> we should just end this now. The whole show, really. That'd be fun. All right, good night. Wait, we have a show, don't we? Yes, on Monday. Month? Come on, everybody. Is it this Monday coming up? This upcoming uh, Monday, the whatever the fuck. 20-something is? Yeah. Uh, the fourth Monday, yeah, we're, just as a general principle, we're doing the second and fourth Monday of we every book month. book that show. It was great last it time. It was. Thank you for everybody who came out. Yeah. Um, we're gonna find a witch to turn Adam into a man for the show. Yeah, and then, a witch. And then after that, she's going right back to his state as a. Aren't all wi- it doesn't witch mean feminist now? Isn't that like a feminist? There are thing? a lot of women who say they're witches, but they just have black mate. Yeah, that's lipstick. like a Tumblr thing. <laughs> yeah, 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 like a goth girl. They, they all, that just they means all... you like suck and. Yeah, yeah, you have yeah. crystals and shit. Yeah, you're like not particularly attractive and mm-hmm. yeah, you're kind yeah. of rude. Absolutely, you're rude. But yeah. you say it's because you're a witch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just like the women in Salem that were persecuted. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Years ago, you channel their spirit. They live through you. Yeah. And you're being a being a mean to men. Right. That's getting back for those the, women would have hated you. They were also Puritans. Yeah. 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 They, <laughs> yeah. They were slightly cooler Puritans. That yeah. doesn't make them cool. Uh. uh, uh. Yeah, you know what movie I tried to like but couldn't? Uh, the, the Hocus Pocus, The Witch. Yeah, Hocus Pocus, I loved. Dude. That's <laughs> the Witch, movie. I actually really liked. I, it just didn't do anything. What's The Witch? The, it was cool. The, a horror movie from like a year ago. No, I never saw. It was yeah. There was a fucked up little. Have you seen Adam, the can't, Adam would be afraid of the movies. So he, can't, <laughs> he can't see movies that he's afraid of. I'm not afraid of any movie. Yeah, huh? I've never been afraid. You're afraid of... It's um, a movie. Why would you be afraid? You're afraid of that one movie where it's like a lizard and he kind of looks like he Hunter S. Thompson. Um, but it's you're afraid because it's a lizard and he's going to eat you. <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you talking about Fear and Loathing in Las nah, Vegas? No, but there was, a, there was, there was like a, a lizard version of it. What was that? What? There? There's this scene where he's tripping Ringo? and he sees l- lizards. Ringo. Yeah. Or something like that. Yeah, you're, that's what you're afraid of. Yeah, oh, the Johnny afraid. Depp movie? Because he'll eat you. Rango. Rango. Yeah, I never saw that. But you're it looks afraid bad. Because you're afraid of it. Yeah, I couldn't afraid. get into the witch. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so that, I liked it, man. That, that wraps up. Oh, they got fucking Blade Runner coming out on 4K Blu-ray. And Ooh. they have a new Blade Runner in the theater. 2069. Looks Blade sick. Runner. Yeah. You think it's going to be good? It looks like bad. I should like watch sick. a movie or something. I haven't considered what, is, what makes something look good or look bad? I mean, just rebooting Blade Runner or whatever looks bad to me. Sounds bad. Sounds bad. Oh. Uh, you know what? That sounds bad. The other one looks bad. I wanted to like the other one. I love David Simon. You should watch it. I might watch it, but also I mean, Maggie not, Gyllenhaal. I don't know why I'm standing up Ma- for it. Maggie Gyllenhaal. No, it's good. Yeah, she's got very droopy she's 70s titties. She's weird. Yeah, but it's good for the character. She's she's the What do you mean she's weird? Throat? Uh, Linda Lovelace? No, yeah. she's not her. She just plays like a like droopy, big old pair of droopy 70s titties. You know what I'm talking about? I How do. in the I 70s, 100%. the titties they were droopy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And she plays like a mom that's like. You know what else you know, you don't see a lot? In like in early Playboys, they had very co- conical titties. Yep, the nipples. They were fucking like, fat we've titties. We've talked about this before, but Apollonia and Godfather Part 2. Yes. Godfather Part 1. No, no, she had puffy nipples. That's a different puffy, difference. Puffy, coney kind of. But hers weren't that big. I'm talking big, fat m- missiles, missile titties. Yeah, I think that's from like early boob jobs. No, I think it's because the, the bras. The bras. Yes. Oh, that's right. That makes sense. Well, I, I, I just, I wish we could 
come up with different bra shapes to force women to wear so you can make them any shape we wanted. Squares. Like Play-Doh. Mm. If I have a wife, I'm going to what design gonna- custom bras in my woodworking shop that she will be forced <laughs> to wear to create breasts of all shapes. I you think know? I like round. I... I like a nice long tit, <laughs> like, a, like a big TV a tit, like remote. A, like, oh yeah, you know, like with a, buttons on it. A banana. That's titty. What I'm talking about like 35 nipples. Oh, all on you the top. want buttons? Yeah, dude. Will they do things? Uh, or are they cosmetic mostly? Yeah. I mean, if I could figure out a way to wire up my wife, you know, <laughs> get some fucking wires in that body of hers, into it through her pussy. Have her. We're talking about the perfect woman here. So six yes. tits, Would all you? remote shaped. They all hook up to my AV receiver. <laughs> Brain removed, pulled directly out of her fucking body. What are we putting there instead? That's right, folks. A pussy. <laughs> Another pussy. <laughs> right on top of her head. I play with my remotes and I fuck the top of her head. <laughs> and her, the ass. You get oh, another. Yeah. You re- replace the asshole with another pussy. Mm. Put some nipples on those ass cheeks. Oh yes, an ass. Titty. You're sucking those ass titties. Yeah. <laughs> Feet, cut them off. Replace them with more titties. <laughs> She's bouncing. Yeah. I, I like don't know that. what you're thinking, but what about the companionship aspect? If she doesn't have a brain. Fuck that shit. Now we're talking. Mm-hmm. Who, ca- who needs companionship? I've got aggression. Mm-hmm. You know? I'm angry about the world. You don't need friends. No. You're, you can just stay angry. You need some it. ass titties to fuck. Yeah, that's cool. It is cool. You know? Who needs who needs the companionship of a woman when I got my trusty CB radio? <laughs> <laughs> and the other guys out there on the road that really knows what it, what it means mm-hmm. to do your own surgery. That's right. On your spouse. So, would you fuck a real girl doll? A real doll? I mean, I guess, but I wouldn't... Uh, like, if there was one in front of me and I was horny, I guess. I wouldn't buy one. Like, as a fleshlight, you would, like, use it to... to yeah, to come. To come. Yeah, I wouldn't take it out on a date. What if, like, when the technology gets better and it's, like, then fucking the a answer person? Is still yes. Nothing has changed. Yeah, you don't understand what how you hypotheticals mean? work. Would you fuck a real doll? Yeah. Yeah, but what if they were better? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is like one of my hypotheticals. No, what I'm saying is like, Ask would you it. like, would you pursue that? If No, I would not buy one. If there was like a, some sort of android type sex robot. How much, or how much do they cost? And it was the best How sex, good does it feel? You could just go like a prostitute. 50 mm. bucks. And have like the best robot yeah, sex of your life. Yeah, probably every once in a while. Just to, just if to have it's a your robot nut, to get your nut. Yeah, because my biggest problem with prostitution is I don't I don't want you feel bad that I you're hurting bad. a person's feelings. Not that I'm hurting the person's feelings. You're making you're ruining her day. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'd be a bright spot, dude. You know, I yeah. get prostitutes. I give them back massages. <laughs> Either pussy. Watch some. Watch the Office together. You eat them out. Yeah, can, can you eat an, a prostitute's pussy? I feel like it would be strange. I feel like you have to pay more. Because I, I do enjoy... What do you mean you feel like? You know this for sure. Yeah, yeah. Tell us from your personal experience. I've yeah. never I've never eaten a prostitute's pussy before. <laughs> Why? Are you afraid? <laughs> That's the Sounds scary. like somebody's a scaredy cat. God damn. I love, I love that we had to make you say the f- sentence, <laughs> I've never eaten a prostitute's <laughs> pussy before. Yeah, you put yourself in that situation <laughs> by wandering into that web. <laughs> Luckily, it's a metaphorical one. A literal web would kill you. Yeah. Well, I guess we should end the show. Yeah, it's about time. Yeah. <laughs> yep. It's about time. Yeah. 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 Yep. It's about time. Yeah.